So, we have a folder containing multiple CSV files, and our goal is to combine these, making analysis easier. If we have a quick look at each file, you can see their structural consistency. They all have the same number of columns and the same column names. In Excel, on the Data tab, go to Get Data. Hover over From File and choose From Folder. Navigate to the folder containing the files and click Open. That brings up a window with details about each file. In the bottom right, there are several options with what we can do. Now, the fastest option would be to click Combine and Combine and Load. The problem is, as you'll see in a few seconds, there are changes that need to be made. So we're going to go for Combine and Transform Data. A preview window pops up and you can already see it's added generic column headers and relegated the ones we want to the first row of the data. Click OK and the Power Query Editor opens so we can make the necessary adjustments. Let's start off by right-clicking on the first column and selecting Remove, as we're not interested in the original file name each row belongs to. Next, we need to get rid of the repeated column headers, so click on the icon in the top left and select Remove Duplicates. This leaves a single row of them remaining. The problem is, it's at the top of the data. However, use the top left button again and choose Use First Row as Headers to promote them. We're happy enough with the transformations made, so click on the Close and Load drop-down, Close and Load 2, choose Existing Worksheet, and then OK. The combined data has successfully loaded into the worksheet so we can proceed with our analysis or whatever we want to do next.